Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe, you don't have to, of course, but it would really help me out somewhere I'm trying to get my channel to be. Okay, so I can hardly believe it, but this clip is to capture my Invisalign number 12. Wow. Honestly, how the process has gone on, it's absolutely incredible. And the results I've seen up until now, which is, uh, I, I have one, I have, um, 14 division lines, uh, so I'm on 12 of 14, that's what I was trying to say, um, so I'm on number 12, and just the results, if I had to finish right now, I would be absolutely, wholeheartedly, very, very pleased. As you can see, perfectly aligned teeth straight away. Just a quick recap on why I had a visual line. When I was 18, 19 years of age, I had... Uh, Oh, the Damon Wired uh, braces, teeth straightening treatments. I had that when I was about uh, 18, 19 years of age. Fantastic results all the way through. Had them on for about 18 months. It was a fine experience, not a problem at all. The same specialist who was looking after me then is now looking after me now, 10 years on. Yes, can you hardly believe it? I'm going to be 30 years of age in a couple of weeks' time. Um, <laughs> but you know, which is absolutely fine with me. I was more petrified at turning 25 than I am at 30. I'm really looking forward to my 30s. Um, and that's not me just saying that. I actually really am. Um, okay, so getting back to that. So yes, and then about nine, I say nine months, I'd probably say about maybe a year um, maybe about a year ago, possibly a little bit more, I started to notice that this arch of my teeth here was starting to come inwards. Um, now, there was a number of reasons why that could have possibly have happened. I'm going through some health things at the moment as well, which is a very long, drawn-out process of genetic specialists looking into possibly different causes of collagen disorders or one thing or another with it, because um, I've had quite a long history of different operations in hernia problems and hearing loss and one thing or another, and they do believe that it's connected. So my dental specialists thought that possibly may May be connected to those type of issues being their collagen based or, or bone related, whatever have you. Um, but however, there was no definitive uh, answer to be able to say that. So I thought, you know what, not a problem. Let's just get on with it and let's resolve the problem because I didn't want my teeth to change anymore because I really liked um, how straight my teeth were. So, and I actually noticed it from my channel that there was a sort of a, a collapsing of the arch coming inwards. So I had quite a, uh, almost a shadow on my teeth on one side and I smiled. Whereas now, as you can see, you can see every one of my teeth at the top. Really, really nice. I have them whitened often. And I'll always be transparent, very, very clear with you. I love to have my teeth whitened as well. So no toothpaste is going to get you to this whiteness at all. This is, uh, whitening treatments in a dental, uh, office. Um, it's really, really good. I treat myself to it once every now and again. Unfortunately, it's got a lot more expensive um, in the last year to 18 months from what I used to pay. Um, but for a visual line, it is an investment in yourself. It really, really is. But it also is an investment in your confidence and on your face to be honest, stepping forward in this life, in this world. So for me, if you are in that position and you're thinking about it, then do your own research. And from my heart to yours, it's certainly worth it. The results I've had from January, and we are on the 23rd of June, is just incredible. So yes, six months, but it has been incredible. The results I've had, the arches come back out, my teeth have changed shape. It's just amazing. It's giving me back my confidence. It's giving me back the fullness on the side of my teeth. I'm confident with it. I'm really, really pleased. And I just can't thank my dental specialist enough. So I'm really, very happy with the results. Um, if you'd like to know more about my journey on all throughout all of my uh, Invisalign stages, then I captured it right from number one. So please do take a look. Um, and yeah, hopefully you enjoy it. So Invisalign number 12, any problems? No. Do you know what? In comparison to a lot of my other stages, I think six, seven and eight, Maybe I'll watch this back and I'll be slightly wrong, but six, seven, eight, maybe nine was quite uncomfortable, quite painful. When I say painful, it's almost like a, a, a pulling sensation on the teeth, almost like that you've literally got hold of the teeth and pulled um, outwards, um, which just a couple of paracetamol sets that discomfort down. It's not excruciating pain. It's just an uncomfortable irritability. Um, as to speak. And uh, yes, yeah, so number 12, I haven't had any of that at all. It's been really, really comfortable. However, I had noticed some small changes, just the shape on the arch here, uh, just kind of the perfecting last stages, I think now. So I've just got a vision line number 13 and 14 to go. I did have an appointment uh, during the period of my vision line number 11, just before I went on a holiday to COS. Um, 
and my dental specialist thought that just to get the top sort of end of my treatment and the last couple of sort of areas polished off um, in terms of where they should sit, that I may need a couple more Invisaligns. But however, because of how well I've got on with the treatment phase, that actually that he didn't think that I may need that. But yet he left it on my treatment plan just in case. But do you know what? I'm happy with the results now. So when I get to 14, goodness knows what it's going to look like because I'm really, really pleased with it now. I was two visual lines ago, so really pleased, really excited with the results. Love the results. Um, and yeah, can't recommend it enough. Now, I did say my last uh, visual line uh, number 11 capture because I done a bit of a rush because I just come back from holiday. Had a beautiful time in the Greek island of Kos. Absolutely lovely. If you've never been there before, I wholeheartedly recommend Greece and I wholeheartedly recommend Kos, a beautiful part of the world and very much so untouched by tourism. So absolutely love that. Um, now, uh, the one thing I did just want to capture for this clip, I'm just going to pause, so bye for now. Hello again, they say preparation is key, didn't they? And I did prepare earlier, but the sun was shining into the room so much, I couldn't do my clip, so I waited a little bit later until the sun just went down a little bit more. Um, so I wanted to show this scan box pro, which is how I do my dental scans. Um, so let's, let's see little box, it's in here. It opens out to this. Okay, and then what you get inside here, okay, is you get this sort of frame here, you get a little bag which covers it if you wanted to, I've never put it in here, um, and then under all of this you have these little weird contraptions here. So. I monitor my progress in my dental journey through an app called Dental Monitoring. Absolutely incredible. You do the scan yourself, which I'm just going to show you in a moment, but not with my phone because it's really difficult to see the camera. And then what happens is you take this piece of apparatus here, and then you clip this piece in, all the way around, this here, and then the phone captures into this piece here, then you shrink it down to the size of your phone, and then you make sure that the camera, so the back end of your camera, is facing into this tube here, okay? And then this piece here, a little button on the side, you just make sure that your phone is captured in with your camera piece here, capture it in here, and then what you do is you look in the mirror when you do your scan, and then this mouthpiece here, you put your mouth in, so all your cheeks all around here, and then it pulls your teeth wide out open, so it can see every element of your teeth, um, your gum area and everything like that, and then you follow the steps from the app, and then you do your scan. So I do my scan myself, um, it's really super easy, really super cool, I've not had any problems at all, and then you upload that to the app, dental monitoring, okay, then from there, your dental specialist or whoever's managing your treatment says yay or nay to whether or not you can move forward to your next stage, and if there's any problems at all throughout that, outside of your scan periods, you can also do uh, like a, an additional scan if you've had any in uncomfortable areas or irritability or anything like that at all. There was only one occasion, which was I think about on a visual line two or three, and one of the nodules on my vision line, and I say nodules because so your vision line can clip onto your teeth, you have like little bits of ceramic fitted on. So for me, I had them all on this side here and then on the eye tooth, and I had one or two here so it could create the shape. The vision line had something to click onto to create the shape and the straightening treatments. Um, I had one nodule here which was giving me constant ulcers up here for about a month. Um, so I got in touch with the app. I put the details through, which was causing me a problem. They got me into my dental specialist, and he had a look, and he recommended me a product. So the issue, to be honest, was just banished, and I didn't have any issues anymore. It's been an absolute smooth, slick treatment process. The app is absolutely incredible. It means that with a busy life, with a busy role, I don't have to keep going in and out the dental office all the time. I can just manage my treatment at home or manage it in my spare time with the scan box and the dental monitoring app, and it's just incredible. So vision line number 12 for me has been an absolute breeze roll in the park, I think. Um, and yeah, really looking forward to a vision line number 13. And I'll be really, really sad to stop all these clips. And then on a vision line 14 after that, that'll be it. We will be done and we will be having a look at the end results. So I'm going to try and capture the beginning and the end results and see if I can uh, put something together to be able to capture that for you as well. Okay, so if you do have any questions or anything like that at all for me down below, please leave them. Um, don't be afraid to ask whatever if you want to know anything in terms of cost. I will be absolutely uh, very, very honest with you if there's anything you'd like to ask, even outside of this topic, um, teeth straightening. Perhaps you want to ask a different question about something else we covered on my channel. Please feel free to do so. Um, it's absolutely a privilege and a pleasure to absolutely receive so many comments, so many questions, and so many just really, really awesomely great comments. So from my heart to yours, thank you very much. Um, and yeah, take great care. God bless. And I will see you 
real soon on my channel. Take really great care, and I'll be seeing you soon. Bye now.